Well, the reasons we pump water from an aquifer are the reasons we use water every day for drinking water, um, for household use, for municipal supplies. Um, obviously, from the High Plains Aquifer, the main use is for irrigation, uh, for agriculture. We also use it for things like uh, cooling in industrial settings. And the reasons we use water from streams are, are pretty much the same. And the reasons we might use one versus the other has to do with cost, the, the availability and, and the cost of getting that water. Um, in, in certain areas, you, you can't get surface water because it's fully appropriated. In other words, all the claims have already been made to that water. So someone seeking a water supply may go to the groundwater instead. And if similarly, if streams aren't flowing in a particular area, it may be easier and more cost effective to get um, groundwater for a particular use. The amount of water that you can withdraw in any particular area in any state depends on those local and state uh, mandated uh, restrictions. So in Nebraska, the control is mostly local and it may vary from uh, one natural resources district to another. In other states, however, such as Texas, it's set by uh, state law. And so it's not the same everywhere in the High Plains Aquifer. It really depends on which state you're in and which part of that state you're in. Well, education is key. Um, the more we can educate individual crop producers about the proper use of agricultural chemicals and how they can um, impact groundwater supplies, the more that they can do to be good stewards. And I would, I would characterize them as um, generally these producers want to be good stewards. They want to do the right thing. So the, the more we can educate them, the better. And there are education programs in place, mostly run by the natural resources districts, by the university extension, and, um, and we do what we can to educate them. Now there is government authority over um, specific levels of pollutants in groundwater and the State Department of Environmental Quality um, oversees those pollutants and um, if we find that those pollutants reach certain levels uh, we can, the, the, the DEQ, the Department of Environmental Quality, can go in and, and mandate that certain restrictions take place. I think water means a lot to this state, means a lot to this region, and it means a lot to me personally. Um, being a native of Nebraska, I've seen how irrigation um, has benefited this state in terms of its agriculture. And because of that, I want to make sure that um, I'm doing what I can to uh, help protect those supplies for future generations. And so I think I'm trying to do my part in, in uh, protecting the natural resources of this state. And um, um, I think that, that irrigation development in this state has been an important um, thing that it, it's been important in terms of, of um, uh, helping us uh, grow economically, I think. And we want to sustain that into the future.